Hi and welcome to this Blueberry Markets video update with me, John Kibler, Head Currency Analyst. In this video, I'm going to be taking you through how I took a dollar Swiss short this morning um, and why I took the dollar Swiss short this morning. And if you're watching this on YouTube, please give this a thumbs up and a like if you learned something new. Um, also, subscribe to the YouTube channel for more videos, okay? Um, if you're watching this on Trading View as well, uh, comment below and follow us on trading view for more okay so in this video i'm going to be breaking down dollar swiss so i'm just going to go to the weekly chart and just show you what's happening on dollar swiss and you can see that the market has pushed back into this key resistance zone up around around the one zero one hundred area okay and what we expected was a little bit of dollar weakness to come into play at the start of the week so we were looking for short opportunities on dollar swiss now Going down to the daily chart, we can see that yesterday we finished bearish off the resistance. This gives us an opportunity to look for short opportunities going into the next day. So just jumping down again to the four hour time frame, again using those time frame correlation techniques, we're looking at the market has formed a double top pattern up at that key resistance level. Now what we expected was the market to break through close below this level and continue lower now we did get that slightly yesterday but we wanted to see another follow through another lower low lower close to confirm that this market is a is actually moving to the downside and what we're seeing at the minute was the fact that the market could actually trade back within the double top area so last night we looked at the fact that what would happen in the Asian session okay so in the Asia session last night we saw the market just slowly creep higher and this is a really good thing because when we looking at the um, the day momentum to continue the next day um, if the market in the Asia session has moved opposite typically what we see is the European session come in and take over and send the market the other way so what we were looking at this morning was the potential for this market to break lower what we also noticed was the fact that the market impulsed lower and formed this bearish pattern in here okay so what we did was we looked for the short opportunity around this area using our ATR as stops so ATR is around about seven I wasn't comfortable with a seven pip stop loss here I wanted to double that to make it 14 just so I'm a little bit more comfortable with giving the market a little bit more room to breathe cover spreads and all that kind of good stuff and uh, the market then turned broke through closed through our counter trend trend line support and looks to be continuing lower so how can we try this now now that we've got this confirmed close below this key double top neckline what I expect is the market to come back retest that neckline structure find some bear bearish uh, price action and then continue to the downside okay so fully expecting this market to retrace slightly before seeing any kind of further downside okay so that's how you can use your multiple time frames to enter a position um, on your uh, account okay so what we're looking for here is the fact that we've broken down the market from the weekly being at resistance the daily confirming a, a bearish close four hour showing us a double top pattern one hour breaking out of a continual bearish pattern okay so looking for further downside here on dollar swiss also if you're a moving average trader as well you'll be good you'll be nice to see that the fact that we traded back within our moving averages and the market continued lower okay so again you can look for something similar the market pulling back retesting the mean averages and continue into the downside okay hope you enjoyed this video update it's been john kibler head currency analyst at blueberry markets check out our website below in the link uh, we've just sent out a, a nice seasonal pattern um, uh, on investing.com as well go check that out follow us on telegram uh, for more updates also please give this fun video a thumbs up if you learned something new and subscribe to our youtube channel for more updates also thanks for joining me today and I'll see you soon.